Now, I came across this recently, so I'm assuming some of y'all out there have as well. Let's say you throw on one of these preset transitions here, and it swipes across the screen. Well, that looks a little bit boring having it just come across all at the same speed. So having the transition selected, you come up in the inspector under transitions, and you go ahead and select in and out. That way it comes in slower, and then it goes quickly across the middle and kind of goes out a slightly slower as well. But that didn't really do much of a change. It really looks not much different than it did the first time. Well, I have one here that I already adjusted, and I think that looks way better. It's a subtle adjustment, but I just think it's way better looking. So I'm gonna show you how to adjust that right now after you hit the like button and subscribe up to the channel. So we have that same first transition right here. You see we have that white line going across, and we already did the part where we selected in and out. Now we go ahead and adjust that curve. And you can see my mouse right here. Now go ahead and come up over here next to all these other ones, Media Pool, Index, Sound Library, and you want to click on Keyframes. Now once here, you want to come over to the left. We're actually on this one right here, Parameters. You actually want to click on Keyframe Curve. Now once we see the Keyframe Curve, just go ahead and click on that line so you have it selected. But we want to click on one more thing up under these three dots this little drop down, you wanna go ahead and show the handles. This is the part that you actually drag to adjust. Now, hypothetically, you wanted to make it look exactly like the one I got. You can go ahead and drag it over here. We'll go about midway through this point and go ahead and click on this dot and drag it about midway through that point. And if I didn't mention this red line is where the playhead is right now. So if you move it around over here, you can see it moves around. I like to adjust it with it right in the middle of the transition. Now I will note, no matter how you wanna adjust this, if you wanna make it a real steep curve, if you actually want to pull this down, you want to pull this up, you can have all kinds of crazy things. It's whatever your mind desires of how you want it adjusted. Now we can see this looks pretty much exactly the same way as I had it pre-adjusted. Now I would highly recommend, so you don't have to do this every time, go ahead and right click on that transition down here in the timeline and go down to create a transition preset. Now you can go ahead and name it whatever you want and go ahead and click OK. But where are we going to find this? Now, when you're looking in the effects library, it's a transition, so it's obviously gonna be under transitions. You go ahead and scroll down to where you have user right here, and there's the transition we created right there. 